What's going on, everybody? Welcome to episode 8 of our Leicester career mode. And today, two games for you. We have our Europa League game here. As you can see, after two games, everyone's on three points. And we have Liga Warsaw here. Winner, obviously, moves into the top two with a bit of a gap. As for our second game, it is against Brentford in the league. And we've been pretty good in the league. Last episode, a 1-1 with Palace that we should have won, really. And then a 0-0 with United that we had chances to win. So, you know, not too, too bad. But um, hopefully, you know, we can one-up it against Brentford and Ligia here. As you can see, they play three at the back with an extra player back as well. Hopefully, we can go ahead and take charge in this group. Let's go. It's Castagne on Warren's side. Here's Madison. And he goes with his foot there, his right foot, I was going to say. He just goes with his foot, I would hope, I guess, as that hits the bar. Very, very close there. I thought he had found the back of the net, but not quite. Lovely football, this, as it comes out here to Barnes. And Barnes is on it, and Barnes slides it across. And I hate how that's not an easy tap-in, as that's going to come over here and into the back of the net anyway. It's a good finish. It's Daka with the goal, but surely those crosses... You press Y, you put it out in front. They got to at least put some something there. I mean, that's a tap-in. It should be a tap-in. It's a dreadful pass. It doesn't matter. Daka is acrobatic. It gets clipped away. Comes down to Vardy who has a shot. It's blocked away. And Daka, with the bicycle kick, finds the back of the net. He should have had a tap-in. Instead, he has a, a brilliant goal. And we have taken the lead here in a game where I can only see our shirts. Stanya gets it out there to Barnes. That's a good run being made there by Vardy, whose touch takes him a little bit wider than I would have liked. Or it was just a little bit heavier than I would have liked. And it's a decent save at the near post. Here's the ball coming forward here. Can we find Vardy? We can. Nicely done. He slips that out there brilliantly. We clip that back pose. Barnes scores. Lovely football, that. And we take a 2-0 lead. And that's just what we needed. A little bit of breathing room. It's lovely football. Great ball out there. And Barnes is just coming in at the back post. The cross is perfect. And the header. Zero chance for the goalkeeper who didn't make a move. 28 minutes gone and we're 2-0 up. Lovely stuff. Good hit. Good save. I can't see it. Sometimes they hit it and I think it's a pass. <laughs> and I'm just hoping that it doesn't fly into the back of the net. As one of those, as that comes in, and that is at the bar. That one I saw. It's a good turn, good hit, good save. And these moments now where we can't really get the ball out on corners is difficult. They're, uh, they cause problems, especially when you can't see. From Ligia. Good block, and it's going to be a penalty. What in the world is that? Didn't even push any buttons. It's a bad touch. He's bringing him down for no reason. Oh, I can't believe it. We were cruising. Oh, and it's gone in off the bar. Just. Man. I can't believe it. What is Ndidi doing? Why is he making that tackle like that? I don't know. But, man, we were in cruise control, it seemed. Uh, hits the bar and just goes over the line. It's a tough break. We still have the lead, but it's no longer as comfortable as it really should be. Played back nicely. Right through the middle here. Now, indeed, he's making a move into space. Didi can get that out there. It's lovely stuff. Can Samari get to that? He can. Here's Pereira. Clips that back post. Can Vardy get up? Not quite. And Well, Vardy's on it now. and Up in the air. Indeed, he can he get to it? A header comes in. What a save. Oh, and the ball's bouncing around. A soft, cushioned header out. A couple of opportunities there. And I'm messing up names and everything. Nice play here. Just hoping not to get mess this up it's a good way to keep that in but it goes out for a corner with a minute to go and we need to uh 
hold on here as that gets headed down and it's indeed he's on it. And no way he's giving that away like that. I can't believe that. As that gets clipped back post, can we get the header on? We can. Get the ball out, we do. And that'll be game over. And we are going to come away with the three points. That is huge. Absolutely huge. I genuinely had such a hard time seeing that entire game, but we will take the points and we will move on and hopefully never have to come back here as Napoli draws. So we go two points ahead of second and two points ahead of third, which is very, very good. We have an injury here. It was Vardy. He's out for five days, which means it looks like he's going to miss the Brentford game, which a little bit difficult, but we will have to work through it. We bring onto the bench James Justin, I suppose. But, you know, we're going to have to work through it. Let's see if we can grab the win. A lot of tired legs out here. Justin is going to start wherever we put him. There he is. Jesus, I'm blind. Um, I'm going to start Eze here. Assuming I can just get the clicking right. We're also going to start Mendy as a Samari can stay, I suppose. Fofana can come out. We'll bring Evans in. And then at left back, we can bring Bertrand in. Albrighton can come onto the bench. I guess Shoutery can come onto the bench, though he's so bad it's difficult to deal with. We don't have another midfielder, see? So we're going to need one at some point. Uh, Tillemans is hurt, but just having another young man to come in and, I guess, hold down the fort in situations like this would be nice. So let's jump into this. Brentford, Leicester. Brentford have started really, really well. Let's see if we can get over on them. Get that out wide nicely. Here's Bertrand. That's dreadful from Bertrand. Not only was it to the wrong guy, but it was awful nonetheless as Bertrand comes up and wins it again. And we can slide that back here to Barnes who strikes it and oh, straight at Raya. Man, that's a humongous opportunity. Bertrand made up for his mistake and almost gives us a goal back. Or not a goal back, just a goal in general. Here's the Anacho. Can slide that out there nicely and it's Bertrand tight angle blocked away. It's going out for a corner. Gets clipped in. Can Iannaccio get to that? No. It's going to float around in that box for a little bit and then get cleared. Here's Samare. Uh, you got to turn all the way around when you do stuff like that. And I've let him through. Johnny Evans is going to struggle to get back here. And it's Visa. He scored. I can't believe it. We were playing well. Again. Playing well, and we just concede silly goals on the counter-attack. It's too easy. He gets through. There's no chance in Johnny Evans coming back. This is why I don't play Johnny Evans, and I don't play Vestigard. <sighs> Slow center backs are unusable in FIFA, and he gets beaten there, and there's no chance of redemption. And unfortunately, it has cost us a goal here against Brentford, and this is not a stadium you want to go 1-0 down and... Oh, what has happened here? Tony off the bar. What in the world happened there? Where did the center back go that was covering? As we almost give the ball away there, and thankfully we don't. Mm, Jesus, a little bit of luck there. Nicely done. Oh, there's a run to be made there by Daka. It doesn't quite come as that comes instead, and it's Barnes. And Barnes can slide it out there one more time. Back into Dak, who takes a touch. Dreadful. Come on, these have to be on target, man. I cannot be holding the button over there that much. They've got to be on target. Nice ball there. That's a good ball wide. Here's Barnes. Cuts back inside. Slides it out there to Mendy, who takes a strike. Oh, it's just wide. Oh, I thought for a moment he at least forced a save. Oh, very, very close. That gets played up the pitch here to Anthony, and Anthony can push away. It's a nice ball out there to Lookman. And Lookman, Jesus, what is that touch, lad? What is that touch? And Suyunchu's chasing in Buemo. 
chasing. Comes back, 2-0. I can't believe we're going to lose this game. Man. Considering how well we've been playing in the Premier League. Ugh. Said we didn't want to get behind in this stadium. And that's why it's pushed ahead. Schmeichel comes out. It gets played back. And look at all the space that Visa has to put in there. Unfortunate. Typical in a way as to the season so far. But not typical to the way things were going, which is the most annoying part. As I said, we weren't being outplayed here. We're just not finishing, but anytime they get a chance, it's a really good chance. And in the end, it could have been more. Could have been three right there, but <laughs> as I said, this this game is going to end, and it's not nearly what the score says. We deserve something out of this game, and it's a shame that we're going to get nothing out of it. They keep getting headers. Jesus. Out of play it goes. 2-0 the final. Brentford get us there at home. They've done that in real life quite a bit so far. But undeserved, in my humble opinion, that result for Brentford. As you saw, they had three shots at the end there. And they still, I mean, didn't play, didn't put in enough really, in my opinion, to get them those points but on we move as Tillemans is back he can come back onto the bench he can come back into the lineup for the moment and Vardy can come back onto the bench now I'm just going to put him in the lineup and he should be fit for the next game but you know we shall see but this is going to be the last episode of two games from here on out it'll be three games I've run out of my trial and in a day or two when you're watching this, when I've recorded it in a day or two, I will have full I will have full access to the game. And I will be able to do our regular three game schedule. And we will be back in full running form with our next episode. And as you can see, it starts against Arsenal and we have Warsaw again this time, thankfully, at home. So we have Arsenal next, Warsaw, and Leeds. And that'll all happen next episode, guys. But that is gonna be it. I hope you folks, of course, have enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more. In peace.